does the U.S. federal government even admit to funding the Wuhan lab as of now? Well, I have a reference in this article that I wrote in February that talks about that 2015 article in Nature Medicine and puts a footnote that it was funded in part by uh, Eco Health Alliance, which gets funds from the NIH. Okay. So, so the editors of Nature Medicine said it, but has the NIH said it? Right. I right. am not aware. Right. I am not aware of them saying, well, folks, we have funded gain of function research. One of the key pieces in this was a piece in uh, New York Magazine that sort of blew the lid on this and got me going on trying to research this. This fellow did a tremendous job, in, uh, but uh, that started this whole thing, put, pointing the finger at, well, what's going on here? As far as I know, Tony Fauci, who's been a spokesman about this for months now, right, uh, has never... In, in public in the past few months said, well, we have funded research that could have led to this, which now, is, you know, duplicious in my mind. Yeah I'm, yeah. I'm not saying the guy isn't a brilliant guy. I'm not saying that he did a great job with HIV, you know, and he's done a lot of terrific work in this. He's 70 plus years old. He's a little younger than I am, <laughs> but you know, Sometimes people with tremendous gifts make mistakes. Nobody is infallible. Well, and you already kind of said it earlier, um, and I'm not, I'm not suggesting this. I'm just saying it, it could be a possibility that, you know, right. fo follow the money. I mean, you already talked about following the money, and that's really exactly. – that really, that's what needs to be uncovered is follow the money on this stuff because if we follow the money, we'll probably find out a lot that's going on. 